Katerina Sinekova is a Czech professional tennis player. She was born to a Czech mother Hannah, an accountant, and Russian father Dmitry, a former boxer and her coach. Her younger brother Daniel is also a professional tennis player. At the Mutual Madrid Open 2021, Sinekova and Kretekova were seeded number two but won the title, defeating Schwartz and Dabrowski in the final, their biggest title since Wimbledon 2018. Sinekova became world number one in doubles on 22 October 2018 and held the top ranking for the next 33 weeks. She has won 14 doubles titles on the WTA Tour, including the 2021 WTA Finals and two at WTA 1000 level. Sinekova reached her career-high singles ranking of world number 31 in October 2018 and has won two WTA titles in singles at the Shenzhen Open and Swedish Open in 2017. During the first four months of 2019, Sinekova did not make any significant result in singles but in doubles done much better. She started here with the semi-final of the Premier Level Brisbane International followed with title at the another Premier Level tournament, Sydney International. During the 2020 season, Sinekova continued to struggle with results in singles. Her first standout when she defeated former world number one Angelique Kerber in the first round of the Premier 5 Italian Open in straight sets. She is a three-time Grand Slam champion having won the 2018 French Open, 2018 Wimbledon Championships and 2021 French Open in women's doubles. In singles her best Grand Slam result was at the 2019 French Open where she upset world number one, Naomi Osaka, and route to the fourth round. She has also reached the third round at a further five Grand Slam events. In February 2017, she was nominated to the Fed Cup team for the first time by the captain Peter Pala and she was the third best ranked women Czech tennis player. Sinekova along with Barbora Kretikova made history for Czech Republic as they won the gold medal in the women's tennis double at the 2020 Summer Olympics. On 22 October 2018, she made her then highest singles ranking of place 31, while on the same day, she became world number one in doubles along with Kretikova. She finished here with the same positions in singles and in doubles. Sinekova had a strong season start, winning her first WTA singles title at Shenzhen Open. Sinekova began the tournament by defeating Peng Shui in the first round in two sets, followed with victory over world number four, Simona Halib, in three sets, claiming her first win over a top 10 player. Then in May 2017, she reached the quarter-final of the Prague Open in singles as well as the final in doubles. She continued with good results in doubles, reaching the quarter-finals of the Premier Mandatory Madrid Open and Premier 5 Italian Open. Sinekova started slow season of 2016 but then shined at the French Open where she reached semi-final in doubles alongside Barbora Kretakova. Then at 2016 Wimbledon, she done better in singles, reaching her first singles Grand Slam third round after defeating Pauline Permentia and 13th seed Carolina Garcia. In May 2015, she made good performances reaching singles semi-final and doubles title of the Prague Open. After the third round loss at the French Open in doubles, the following week she reached the top 50. In July 2014, she won her first match on the WTA Tour at the Istanbul Cup after defeating Julia Glushko in the first round.